I'm, I'm glad you popped in anyway, Mike. Having still having a little bit of a uh, bit of problem with the way I look on camera. You see here, look a little bit weird, sort of old. Right, look, Michael. Yeah. I don't know what it is, but something, frankly, has to be done before the next shoot. Yeah, Michael. I hope uh, I hope you don't mind. I've, I've sort of planned a little bit of a pit stop for us this morning. Okay. We got we gotta get to the shoot though. We're running a little late. Well, no, we'll we'll make the shoot, Michael. There's no there's no question there. I'm a professional. But w what's really important at this point is making me look slightly less toad-like on camera. <laughs> I have arranged a little bit of a meeting with um, with a makeup professional, and you know, I spoke with this young lady. She said she could sort of bring out more cheekbones, you know, a little bit more of the eyes. And uh, as I did mention before, Mr. Harrison Ford himself has been known to use these sorts of tricks of the trade. I wouldn't expect you to understand it, Michael. You're not on this side of the uh, this side of the camera. Okay. Michael, I don't want you to think that I'm an egotist. It's more that, you know, I've read that all the American movie stars do this sort of thing. Mm. And, uh, you know, Harrison Ford has been mentioned. Don't move. No, he looks very handsome. Is that Mr. Harrison Ford? You don't think that this is too much? No, 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 not no. at all. Not I, mean, at all. I want you to be subtle. It is subtle, it's minimal. Do I look? Yeah. I look sort of rough. Masculine? Masculine, cowboy-esque. Really? Very, very macho. Alright. Well, let's go then. Cheers, folks, it's Dan Kidd for Intrepid Dan Kidd's Under Boston. We're here at the Charlestown Navy Yard, home of the USS Constitution, a 44-gun frigate known for its exploits in the War of 1812. So let's get Intrepid aboard Old Ironsides. Come on. like a captain, captain's courageous, do you know what I mean? Shoot those guns over there, mate, I'd say. Cheers, folks, it's the intrepid Dan Kidd. I've finally gotten aboard this great ship, the USS Constitution. We're here at the Charlestown Navy Yard. We've met a couple of young tourists here, lovely ladies, obviously sort of the, your typical Americans, and we're going to ask them a few questions. Could we, could we introduce you to the people at home? Yeah, what was your name? Was Julie. It was Julie and... Catherine. Right. All right. <laughs> I asked the red-blooded Texas gals where I could find a copy of the Constitution aboard vessel. You sort of, uh, Julie, explain. Do you know we're not American, right? You, you don't know that? I'm sorry, do you have something in your mouth? I can't understand what you're saying. <laughs> you know, we're not American. We're not from America. We're um, not literally from America, but... But we're not. We're, we're from, from Belgium. Uh, is that in... that's in Arkansas? No, no, no. It's Belgium. In Europe. You know, like near France, Germany, the Netherlands, Luxembourg. Luxembourg. 
It's just between little country, Belgium, you know, chocolate, right. chocolate I'm, from Belgium. I'm really, I'm only familiar with Europe uh, as far as the UK. I've never been out of the UK. The UK. Oh, really? the UK. Because you don't speak other language that English? Well, I speak a bit of German, but German. Oh, you I'm, do? I'm afraid to use it. Well, people, about the Germans, you know what I mean? Do you speak French? <laughs> Not at all. I have heard that French was the international language of love. It is. It is. What can you say in French? <laughs> I sort of raise a more personal question. I might sound a little bit weird, sort of strange, sort of out of bounds. Do it. What size are your feet? My feet? Like the American size or the European size? What are you wearing right now, American or European? European, actually. What size are your feet in European? 38. Really? What I really wanted to find out from you, Julie, yes. is have you heard of Mr. Harrison Ford? <laughs> no, I haven't. I'm sorry. Nice, uh, look nice, your makeup. It's Nice. How do you do that? You should teach me. Yeah, I mean, it's supposed to be very subtle. Do well, I look very strong? Oh, you do. You, you look so strong. So strong. Oh, it's like a brothel. Oh, so yes.